lovely Steve and Gina Merritt. And first of all, we just want to thank Randy, Wendy, Scott, Isabella, the entire corporate team, because I'm telling you what, this event, guaranteed, is going to position you to thrive in your business. You guys excited? Woo! Guys, excited to be here in Italy, all the way from America, and we are just, uh, uh, looking forward to help position you to win and succeed in your business and thrive throughout the end of the year in 2018. Um, our our spo speak is about become the professional. And you know, funny thing is, I walked out this morning, come down to the lobby, and I noticed that my zipper was popped out. Okay, and Gina says, you know, I said, we're gonna be talking about looking sharp, being sharp, being the professional, and my zipper is broken. And she said, don't worry, they won't notice if your zipper is wide open, all right? I said, no, they will, so I had to run up, change, and uh, you know what? Uh, you, you don't have to be so tough on yourself. I mean, oh. every one of the diamonds that come across this stage today started where you're at, all the way up in the nosebleed seats uh, for you to win and succeed. I want to congratulate uh, all of you for being here. You made the best decision for your business future as, being, be, as, as uh, far as being a professional Woo! by being here at Expo 9 Thrive in Rome, Italy. Okay? And we know that many of you uh, struggled to get here. I mean, uh, when we first started, it's like I can remember it like yesterday that we don't have uh, money to put food on the table for the kids. We were broke busted and disgusted. I remember one night we were, but we didn't show it. We were acting as professionals because people were looking at us. On the way to one of our J parties, uh, we had to pull the car over because the toll man would not let us get into the toll because we didn't have any money. And we had to lift up the seats in the back of the car, digging for quarters, and they were very sticky. <laughs> Because we got four kids, so the quarters were like sticking to us when we handed them to the, to the toll man. But we understand where, you, where, where you're at if, you're, uh, if you had to ha have a struggle to get here. But we will tell you this much. The journey is worth it. Uh, we want to talk to you about uh, um, a few keys that helped Gina and myself uh, rocket our way through the ranks of Jeunesse. Yeah, we don't have a lot of time, but we're going to share with you so that you can take this information back and thrive with your business. So number one is commit. Commit to your dream. That's the number one thing you should be doing because your dream is going to keep you going when uh, things don't go exactly how you planned them. The bigger the dream, the less tired you get, the, le the, le the more focused you can be. So make sure before you leave this weekend, you've got a dream that's embraced into your heart that you are gonna take and run for. My dream was to bring Gina home from work. So every time I went to go prospect somebody or call somebody, I thought, if I don't do it, I'm not gonna be any closer to my dream. So I don't know what your dream is, but I know everyone here has a dream for their family. Second is commit to your business, okay? Uh, you made the commitment to be at Expo 9. Now you want to take and make the commitment to be at the next Expo and at lead. You want to get your tickets. That's part of being committed. Your team is watching you, so whatever you do, they're going to do. Go and get your ticket and buy extra tickets uh, for the lead event coming up in March and for Expo next year. So you've got them. The deal is incredible. I think it's 99 euros for both events. How many are you going to bring with you? Get you extra tickets ahead of time. Um, and then you want to take and understand that you want to run in your business. Make it a priority because uh, it's part of how you're going to make it happen. We were busy when we got started. I had two jobs. She was a flight attendant, four kids. But we made our business a priority. We committed uh, to our business. So one last thing on commit. You know, obstacles happen in your life. You have situations. You have life comes upon you. You know, we told Randy and um, Wendy that we would be here at this event. and. 
Last week, our third daughter, we have four kids, our third daughter was pregnant. She lost her baby. On Monday, she had surgery. But we knew that, you know what, hey, we got to figure out what can we do for someone to be with her. So we flew down our oldest daughter with her two little children to take care of Rainy while she was going through this hard time and just having somebody else to love on her. But we knew that we were committed to be here with you. To educate, educate yourself uh, at these events. Take responsibility of your business. Don't make it your upline's responsibility. Take this information home with you. And uh, as you're, if you're brand new, we had so many brand new people last night. Those of you that are here, just getting started, uh, learn what you need to learn. You know, I was a pro water skier for over 25 years. Gina was a professional in her career, both as a flight attendant and the dental industry, okay? We had to become professional at what we did there. It's no different with your Jeunesse business. You wanna be professional, get yourself an information. Don't spend all the time on the products because the doctors have videos for every information there is on the products. Learn also the, the skill sets that you need to learn to uh, sponsor people and help people with uh, objections. Uh, make sure that you are educating yourself and you're staying focused. And you know what, the great thing is you don't have to waste your time in prime time. When people are up after work, Saturday mornings, okay, no problem, you go see the people and, and, and build your business. But in the evening, when everyone is sleeping, you can get yourself up to speed on what the, the leaders uh, in Jeunesse have been doing to win and succeed in their business. So the learning curve is as fast as you wanna uh, get to it. So hey, look smart. You know, dress sharp, be smart, look smart, even if you don't know the right answer. Look like you do, look smart, look sharp. You know, get yourself in shape. It's good to look smart, get your zen body on. Come on, you're gonna be more confident when you get your zen body in, on. Steve and I, we got our zen body on. We are like, woo! Wow. We eat, drink, sleep it, even when we travel. The most amazing program. So be smart about your body, about where you're going, how you look, how you present yourself. Uh, also be smart with your conversation. You know, you need to know people are gonna be asking you questions. A great answer that we had when we first started and we still do it to this day is we just compliment their question. We wrote the, wrote the, read the book years ago, How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie. And he said, the way to make friends, isn't that what we're doing in our business? Right. Making friends. It's not to tell them everything you want. You know, just let them know, uh, compliment them. And when you compliment them with a question, they start leaning forward. So sometimes you uh, want to make sure that you're saying the smart things as far as uh, encouraging your team. I've never seen an industry like ours where people are encouraging each other at every event that we have, uh, uh, during one-on-ones, during any time you're around people. You're letting them know how special they are and that they can win and succeed. Loyal, are you loyal to your dream? I hope you are. Are you loyal to your products? I hope you're using every single product, man. I am not leaving one of the products out because I want to look the hottest I can at 56. You! Yeah! Are you loyal to your upline? Are you loyal to Jeunesse? Are you loyal to Wendy and Randy? Come on! We can make history together. We are going to thrive through the end of the year. Let's be loyal. Have integrity, all right? If you think it's wrong, it's wrong, okay? This business is so important to build with integrity because everyone on your team is watching you and people want to, if you want to have a long-term successful business, you want to always build uh, your business with integrity. I love what you always say. Your business depends on you, which is might be scary, or it could be good, right? So hey, let's make the best of it. Let's stay focused, let's have integrity, let's build it right, let's build it to last so we can have fun all around the world together on all these free trips. Who wants to go to Bali? Come on, you know we what? gotta fill a We're couple plays. 
as we break out of uh, Expo 9 this weekend, when you get back home, you're going to want to focus on your goals. The goals that you set while you were here, that you learned, the skill sets that you learned, you want to focus uh, on your goals as you leave the event. Focus on what it takes to win and succeed in this business. Stay focused, okay? Uh, singleness of focus. Don't be uh, being dragged into uh, something else that's get, making you go over here or someone else might be dragging you here. You've got a dream for your family. Stay focused as we go through uh, the rest of 2018. We've only got 75 days till the end of 2017. What are you gonna do with those 75 days as you break out of here and thrive in your business? Focus on what comes out of your mouth every second of the day. Positive, positive, positive. Focus on every second of what you do because you'll realize how much wasted time you have. If you really got focused, your business would be at a whole new level. And last, we're gonna take and thrive, okay? Uh, are you ready to thrive? Okay, uh, the key to breaking out of here is to uh, take the information that you learned from this weekend. So wow, you know what? I just wanna ask you a couple questions to close it off. How excited would you be to earn the Thrive $10,000 bonus. Show me. Come on. Come on. They want to write a check. I would be like this. Yeah! Come on. OK, OK, let's step it up a little bit. How excited would you be if you went away this weekend with a brand new free Mercedes? Yeah! Uh -huh. Come on. Now the last question, how excited would you be if you hit the level of crown and you earned a one-time bonus of one million dollars? That's what I'm talking about. Hey guys, we believe in you. You are positioned to thrive your business to whatever level you want to go. It is possible. It's worth the journey. We love you and we believe in each one of you guys. Ladies and gentlemen, to the Expo 9 Thrive Stage.